Whoa, yeah. Hello, everybody. And welcome back to more System Shock. Yeah. Getting close to the end here. My name is Ferris Creek. Almost forgot that part. <laughs> but yeah, um, there's a couple of things left to do on this deck, I think. There were a few areas still under lockdown by Shodan, so I want to make sure everything's covered. I don't think I've been in here yet. Um, mag pulse you. Sounds good. Oh, gotta load. Huh. I don't remember this room. I've probably <laughs> spark beam. Let's, um... Was it one I meant to do? Okay, it didn't have any... Didn't have any ammo. Whatever. <laughs> I had my weapons arranged in a way that I kind of liked, and now they're out of order a little bit, but that's okay. Just gonna keep on going. Diagnostic module. Oh, well, you know what? Oh, I have never been in here because I've I've never done that before. I've literally always used my jump jets to get over there. That's how I thought you had to do it. Okay, so I think this is pretty much exactly what I was talking about when I said there is still some stuff left to do. I'm not sure what's in here. Wow, very useful. Glad I came this way. Um, yeah, I think it's time to depart from this deck and go on to the final confrontation. Can't believe we're already almost there. I feel like there was something locked somewhere this way. I'm gonna just kind of check around. Uh, Cause there might be something kind of cool. Don't want to miss out, you know. Probably have been wherever that is. So there's the force bridge. This must be from the other side. No, no, no. This is somewhere else. Interesting. That's the uh, containment cells. 
Okay. I think pretty much everything is accounted for. Monitoring. Okay. Yep, we're gonna We're gonna head to the bridge. After this point, there is no coming back here. So for the first time in this playthrough, I am going to make a separate save file. Charging for firing. Warning. Bridge separation imminent. Atmospheric depressurization commencing. I wonder if I could have made it up here with the jump jets. Alright, gonna save one more time. And listen to this email. Okay, I think more scrambler is working. It'll take Shodan a while before he cuts us off. Listen, when you reach the center of the bridge, look for the primary cyberjack. You can't take Shodan down anywhere but cyberspace. Those computers are so shielded. To destroy them, you'd have to blow the whole bridge. Now, once you're in cyberspace... Cease your pestering, insect. <laughs> Accept the coming of your new lord. Alright, and, uh... Real quickly, before we move on, there's a few logs that I don't think I recorded, or... Anyway, I'm gonna play them now. Fellow children of Union, a dangerous foe to our society lurks in the corridors of Engineering Liberal. Her name is Bianca Schuler. She has opposed my campaign to bring our Lord Shodan to power. Cyborg Detachment 3? Bring this dirty no tech to justice. You know, I never really noticed, but they gave Diego's voice the same Shodan glitch treatment, and it it sounds really good. And uh, it's really cool. Diego is talking about Schuler right there, who was Citadel's only hope before the hacker woke up. To all security maintenance personnel, when the security two bots recharge in the maintenance bay, it drains power from some of the auxiliary systems, like lighting and the automatic doors. In an emergency, you can hit the charge interrupt button to bring the lights and door lock back online and reactivate the robots. My cyborgs, human infection crawls through the pipes into my fortress. Prepare. Construct solid doors with security circuits. Let my elite guard stand before the portal to my sanctum and bathe it in a field of X-rays. Okay. Oh god. Look at this. It's just awful. Ambush by Diego. And what do you know? Access personnel 5. Dead Diego cyborg. So he's finally gone. Wasn't worth it, buddy. You brought me here to do a job and I did it, and look where it got you. Okay. We're off to the bridge. Gonna play for 
couple more minutes and then we'll call it for this episode. Yep, so... Citadel's now... adrift. Got an email, didn't it? Oh, Rebecca. Entered my domain. Rebecca and Morris cannot help you here. No one can. Oh man. I did not mean to skip that. Okay, so Citadel is effectively destroyed. Minus one grove and the bridge. And power is out. Let's go ahead and... I've had this iCAD since deck two, I think. Oh, man. Bridge is pretty gnarly. And it's actually pretty substantial, too. I'm remembering now that there's quite a bit more to it. Um, so I'll go ahead and clear this wing for this episode. Call it good. And before we even touch that button, go ahead and save. So you can get back out. You're not stuck down here, but... sound. I don't know if there's a medical bed up here, either. And I'm wasting quite a few of my first aid kits. I'll do that instead. bugged. It won't stop. It really should stop, but probably detects imminent danger. Danger! Will Robinson. Okay, before I do this, or try to do this. About the same. About the same. <laughs> It likes that. Four wow. store two to computer room open. Four store two to computer room open. All right, let's clear out the rest of these robots. Damn robots. Robots everywhere. Oh, 
So many corners. No, my prize is obsolete. My other prize also obsolete. Okay. I think that's basically everything. Oh, it's a few. He's upset that I forgot about him. As you would be, you know. It... It's upsetting being left out. I'm just making sure there aren't any other hidden little nooks. And that's where we came in, so the elevator is over here. Did I? Yeah, I checked this way. Wow, okay. So that part's done. The other, some of the other parts on this bridge, on the bridge slash this deck, are a little bit tedious, but kind of like this. But we'll get to that in the next episode and probably maybe wrap it up in the next one or in the next couple of ones. We're getting there. So anyway, thank you for tuning in as always, and I'll catch y'all in the next one. How many more times can I say that? Just kidding.